If you don't, I will kill you. There's not a single soul that can escape me for I lay dormant in all of you. Once you succumb to me, you lose all control and you hand it over to me. I'll gladly take the wheel. Let me drive as your boyfriend cheats on you and all you see is red. No! Revenge is your only option. Let's go to both of the houses and shoot them both dead. <laughs> they deserved it. I'll sit in the passenger seat while you remain stuck in traffic, late for something that's probably not as important as you're making it out to be. Go ahead, yell out the window. Blow your horn, curse, curse their them. names. If I'm lucky, they'll have a gun. Watch me as I kill presidents and prime ministers and war rages and cities burn, mothers cry and children die. Watch while your sinful children gather around in one spot, breaking down the virtues of one patient individual. Well, now's my turn. I'll go home with them. And I'll return the next day with semi-automatics. Their parents should be getting a phone call soon. I end lives over drugs. I'm the one that you see in the street beating down another man until his head cracks. And then I continue until somebody tries to detain me. But it's okay. The damage is done. Allow me to shave your heads and lash out against those who look different from you. Race has always been so easy for me. Together we'll scream at your mother for not spoiling you enough. Then we'll call her name she doesn't deserve, cut her off completely. Too bad. She's grown ill in the time of your independence. But it's okay. She's just a bitch after all. I work outward as well as inward. So for the week, I'll get them a nice little rope and tie it around their neck. I get to kick the chair. I am the greatest threat to the existence of mankind. For when God gets his hands on me, you all have something very terrible to fear. Your prayers won't protect you. Nothing.